Hey guys, it's Amber. Welcome to my channel and to a small Scentsy haul. I got in my Father's Day stuff that I purchased and I wanted to share it with you. Um, I didn't get the warmer, although it's super cute. My husband isn't a, a big like smoker person. We don't have a smoker or anything like that. So he does like to barbecue, but it's not something that's like a passion of his. So I was like, there's no real need for us to have it. So, um, so let me just jump into it. What I have to share with you guys. So first off, I did get the um, bundle, the body care bundle of goodies. This is the brand new scent, Sandalwood Tangerine, and it came with the cream shave soap. It came with a fragrance mist, and it came with a body wash. So I got it for my husband for Father's Day. I've heard it is a really good scent. Haven't smelled it yet. Okay, and then I did a six pack of wax. So I got, right, six, yeah. Um, so I received more than the bars that are available for Father's Day. Um, and then a licensed bar as well. So if you didn't know, so Sensi has a bundle where you can get five or six wax bars for the price of five. Um, if you go to, in my website, which I'll have linked below, go to um, the specials tab. And in that tab, there's one that says bundle and save. So if you click on that, um, you'll see the different bundles that we have that helps to save you Monday money. Um, so the one that is for wax bars, the six wax bars, you get uh, six for the price of five. So it's a great deal. So I always try to do that if I can. So I got six and then I got, like I said, a license bar. So I'll just go ahead and show you that one first. So it's the Lion, new Lion King one in the jungle. I've had the Circle of Life um, wax bar before, which is was re-released with the um, Lion King collection this time around. Um, I did not like that one at all. I did not. And there's something in it I just don't like. It almost smells like dirt to me. I don't know. I'm sorry if you like it. You're you know, more than welcome to like it, but I personally didn't like that one. So I'm hoping, I've heard good things about this one. I've heard some people say that it even smells like um, a part of Soarin' Around the World, um, the ride at Disneyland or Disney World. Um, the part within the like jungle or safari part with the elephants, but before the elephants throw the dirt. So it doesn't smell like dirt, but it smells like fresh green type of thing. So I'm gonna smell it now and let's see if I think the same thing. Okay, I kind of get where they're coming from. I don't think it's a total like dupe of that smell, but it's very green. It's a very green scent, like plant green. And there's a like a a fresh sweetness to it. I, I I forgot the notes, of course. I forgot to bring the notes, of course. But very, very nice. Um, if you like those fresh, green, clean type scents, but it's not clean like soapy clean. Nothing like that. So um, I'm excited to give it a try. So that's the Lion King in the jungle. Um, and I apologize in advance if you hear a bunch of banging or anything like that. So we had, or we have bees in our, in our wall. And uh, thankfully it's a place that's easily accessible. So nothing needs to be cut out of our wall or anything like that. Um, but we are humanely re rehoming them. So the beekeepers here trying to take care of that. So if you hear a bunch of banging, if you hear some loud noises, that's probably what it is. So 
thankfully, thankfully, we're um, putting them in a better home rather than the side of our home. Okay, so on to the other wax. I'm going to save the new one for last. So I didn't get every single um, Father's Day bar because um, there was a couple, well, actually, no. So there was one there's a few that I have smelled before. Sorry, I'm rambly today. Um, and one of them I knew I didn't like. It was very cologne-ish. That was Route 66. So I'm not a fan of Route 66. Too cologne and strong for me. So I didn't get that one. Um, but I did get a couple of the others. But first off, before the Father's Day bars, um, I'll just show you the other ones I got. So I got another graduation. I love this bar and it's actually in my Scentsy Club, but my next club doesn't ship until, um, when does it ship? It ships in July and I'm already almost out of this bar. Love this bar. So this is like, it's a weird combination of scents, but it's beautiful. Like when you read the notes, it's weird. It's like apple um, and suede and something else but it's such a unique pretty scent like one of those bedroomy type of scents I love it so much so that's why it's in my club but I had to get another since it's gonna be a minute before my next club ships um it's just a like I said a unique scent perfect bedroom scent and it is one that lasts a long time I can put this bar, um, one, one or two cubes of this in my warmer in my bedroom and it will last me the whole week. So it's a long lasting one, not super strong, but just a nice like background scent, but it lasts and lasts and lasts. So there's that one. I was at a Luna, so I got another Luna. This is a beautiful scent. Even if you normally don't like florals, this is one I always recommend for those that normally don't gravitate towards floral scents or they just can't have fl uh, florals normally. It's so pretty. It's florals and then like berries, I think. It's just a sweet, um, perfumey, pretty scent. So that's Luna and it is in so many things. That should tell you something, how popular it is with how many things it comes in. And then we have Jammy Time. I haven't had jammy time in a wax bar in a while. It's my favorite laundry scent. Um, my favorite washer whiffs and all that. And I do like it in wax. Um, but the, the whiffs is where it's at in regards to this fragrance. Wonderful. I love it. Um, so I got jammy time. Like I said, it's been a while since I've had it. So I was like, oh, yeah, I'll get another one of those. Okay, and then the three um, ones I did get from the Father's Day collection were My Dear Watson. I love this scent in regards to um, a masculine, like, cologne type scent. I really like this one. So it's, it's a, I can't even remember the notes in it, but it's kind of woodsy, sophisticated. It reminds me... Actually, you know what reminds me of this wax bar that was in the fall winter catalog was, um, what was the name of that bar? It was brand new last season. Um, I think it was Eucalyptus Wreath. I think that was the one or no, um, the one that had Sage. I don't remember. I can't remember the name of it now. But there was a new one last season that reminded me a lot of My Dear Watson. So it's a woodsy but not super overpowering um, cologne type fragrance, but definitely masculine. So that's My Dear Watson. And then I purchased Business Casual. I've never tried this one. So I was like, I've heard good things about it and I want to give it a shot. So. Okay. This one seems lighter even than My Dear Watson. It almost has an aquatic type note to it. 
Again, I do not have the notes, I'm sorry. Almost more of, but it's kind of got like a citrus quality as well. But very mild. Almost more of like a, a body wash type fragrance rather than a cologne. Hmm, okay, we'll see, we'll see how that one goes. So that is business casual. And then I also just, um, just to show it, I didn't get it in my um, haul, but this is another one that you can get from the Father's Day collection and it is vanilla bourbon. So this is in my club. This came out last year with Father's Day and I loved it so much. I put it in my club. This is, I think the notes are like um, vanilla, nutmeg, and bourbon. I do not get any sort of boozy note in this. It doesn't smell like alcoholish at all to me, but you do get this vanilla. You do get that spice from the nutmeg. And I guess there's like an added warmth, which might be what the um, bourbon note is in this. It's a beautiful fall fragrance to me. Not cologne-ish but it kind of has like a masculine flair to it, if that makes sense. It's so, so nice. I love it so much. So it is in my club. So that's why I have like a bar to show you, but I don't melt it into the fall. Um, so highly recommend vanilla bourbon. It's wonderful. Okay, on to the final. So this is brand new to the um, Father's Day collection this season and it's Sandalwood Tangerine. I'm excited. So it's a like a burnt umber color. Okay, I do get sandalwood. And I get, I do get like a, a, a bright citrus. This is more citrusy than the business casual. It almost smells like there's sage in it. I wish, oh, actually I have notes right here. Oh, okay. No, it doesn't say sage. It's sandalwood, white cedar, uh, or tangerine, white cedar, and sandalwood. I definitely get the citrus, but it's not like a citrus, like sunkissed citrus type of orange tangerine note. It mixes really well with that sandalwood. I'm not necessarily getting cedar on cold, but it is a masculine scent, more masculine. It's almost unisex actually, but leaning more masculine to me. So there's almost like a sharpness to it. Like it's not eucalyptus, but like that type of quality that kind of astringent quality, which the notes in it don't say. Cedar isn't normally astringent, but that's kind of what I'm getting. So it's nice, it is nice. I'm excited to melt it to see how it does then. Hopefully that cedar comes out because I do really like cedar um, in home fragrance. So that's sandalwood tangerine. And that is everything, you guys. Thank you for spending some time with me. I hope you have a wonderful day. And until next time, TTFN. Ta-ta for now.